Hey guys, it's Queen Gija, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode 30 of Healing Good Pretty Care. BTW, I would have had this out yesterday, but, um, I got my mom a little addicted to some of the anime movies that we were watching, and we went to bed, and then I woke up, and she immediately wanted to finish Spirited Away. <laughs> and so, uh, literally all day yesterday, we were watching nothing but anime movies, and I wanted to get this out, but by the time we finished, it was late, and so I was like, yeah, I'm just gonna have to do this Monday with, um, Drop Idol Fruit Tart, but that's okay. Other than that, let's go ahead and get started with episode 30 and 3, 2, 1, go. <sighs> okay. I don't even remember what happens in this episode because I really don't even remember the preview. <laughs> the zoo? Okay. Uh-huh. <laughs> well, that's nice. <laughs> well, yeah, you you didn't know that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm? Oh, really? I didn't know that. See, now we're going into Kimono Friends territory, and I'm okay with that. See something in my phone real quick. That was weird. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my god. They literally gonna make me want to go to the zoo by the end of this episode. Huh. I mean, woo, how long has it been since I've gone to the zoo? <laughs> <laughs> well, three out of the four, though, but... <laughs> Oh, 
Kimono Friends. One of the other, the other reasons why Kimono Friends got hella popular was because of the shoe bill. Because everybody loved him. Her, really. That and because of the fact that, you know, you got to learn about animals every single week. And I think that was, like, the biggest reason why I and everybody else, like, immediately loved it. Mm. Yeah. You don't want to know someone who's very similar, right? I mean, yeah, it's nice to have same things to be liked as, like, with other people. Like, you can also like anime, books, um, movies, whatever, but there are some things that other people are not gonna like that you like, and that's okay. <laughs> oh my god, Coda. <sighs> so pretty. I know. I always remembered, like, growing up. I would get giraffe jokes because I am so fucking tall. It's a little annoying. It, well, it was, but now I'm just like, hey, I don't give enough. I'm like, hey, giraffes are like literally one of the best animals. <laughs> oh. <laughs> right? <laughs> I don't think I've ever been to a petting zoo. Is it weird that I kind of think this is going to be his last episode? Not, you know, not Kobayashi, because, you know, because you was born from our own main character. But I still have that feeling that these two were also born from someone as well. Damn. She, you know, if she's like, she's like, goes away from working every single time when she tries to get her mom's attention, be like, your name is Ko Kazue? And I'd be like, no, Kazue! <laughs> Poor baby. Yeah, they're cute though. Really? Hmm? That kid? Mm hmm. Yeah, that's okay. But the thing is, does Koto immediately want to reconcile with this kid? Kota. Oh my god, Suichi Kota. I mean, this isn't good for this. Stop.
that's what we're fighting about i mean uh, okay okay but i gotta think about it, uh, think about it as a mind of a little kid yes i i get the fact that they're gonna fight over this but it, it, it's cute <laughs> it's okay little kids are gonna fight over like the cutest little things that may seem hella important to them excuse me Wait, Kota. Yeah, me too. I can't even imagine the price on that. I mean, I ha like I said, haven't been to the zoo. Oh, look at the pizza. Oh, my God. Oh. As I was saying, I haven't been to the zoo in forever, but I, I can't imagine the prices, like, for here. <laughs> I mean, it's like when you go to the movies, like you are spending about probably a hundred dollars just to go to the movies. You're spending like 15 bucks on a ticket, but then you are spending like over a hundred thousand dollars on food. Which is what you need to see with you and Shinji. Yes, you two like different types of animals. But still, at the same time, they are both equally stronger. One isn't stronger than the other. I mean, if they're really... Well, well let's not get into that right now. Because we, we, we would have to look at that as like a totem pole. Aloe? Okay, well, so I'll leave, but aloe? Oh, okay. And it took 13 minutes. And you're going to try something too, aren't you? I mean, because, like, out of the three, yes, he's the only one who truly is successful. But, I don't know. I'm cold. And I'm hungry, too. If you only knew. The fact that Daru is just like, he just sitting there chilling like it's nothing. A big old Kobayashi bullshit. <laughs> like, I can't. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's just, you know, you know, like the memes that they have for Sailor Moon. Like when they transform, the bad guys are just sitting there chilling. <laughs> Him while he's waiting for these girls to do their it's just be 
like, all right, yeah, y'all take it a little too long for me. But like, mm. you know, I got other things to do. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so stupid. <sighs> There we go. That's better until it like flicks out and just bothers me again. <laughs> but uh, uh. Sweetie, yeah. Mm -mm. No, come on. See, that's a good friend. We, we choose now for them to make up. You know what? That's okay. They needed this. Mm-hmm. <laughs> of course. It's okay to agree to disagree. Well, there's two. Of course, he gonna go for her last. No, really? Hmm. Yeah, you're still weak against him. Why do I feel like this is going to end on two-parter? Because, I mean, if it does, there is no pretty kid this weekend. Not until the following weekend. Yeah, but it's okay. I, and I get that, but maybe you shouldn't be. No, 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 no. Don't be like what's her face from um Go Princess. How many minutes we got left with this episode? Okay, we got five minutes. This episode can end any freaking way it wants to, but if it ends on a cliffhanger, we already know episode thirty one's gonna be a two parter.
nice. So we literally just, but uh, okay. So y'all make y'all literally gonna have us wait a week to figure out what the hell happened to her. Y'all serious? This this like some I one ish. Oh. Yeah, I thought your dad would have been back by now. No! Oh, well, she looks even more better, so. That's how we end in it, right? God damn it. And they literally gonna make us wait a week? Uh uh. -uh. Oh. Colta! Why do I feel like his dad's gonna- Oh my god, no. Um, fuck, um, they literally gonna make us wait a whole week to see what the hell gonna happen next. We ain't even gonna have a Halloween episode this year either because Halloween is this week. Oh. I'm about to cry. <laughs> oh my god. What was this episode? I mean, oh, this was good. That ending, that was really good. I don't know why, but I kind of got, um, if anyone has seen the Netflix show, um, Lolly Rock and how the, what a lot of people like to say is the final season ended on with, um, I don't remember her name. The girl, like, one of the bad guys is a girl. Her brother ends up, like, possibly dying. We don't really know because they haven't been renewed for a third season. We're all sitting here waiting for her to come. But she becomes, like, truly evil by the end of season two. And she... Mm, we don't know what she's gonna do and how powerful she is. But, like, oh, I, I just... I'm scared. I hate the fact that we have to wait a whole week. This, mm. Are we finally getting? <laughs> finally. <laughs> Finally, like, oh my god. This took how long for these girls to get their final power up? Oh god, I mean, oh, jeez, this took such a long time. Oh my god, I, I mean, because, like, I was assuming, I think all of us were assuming that by the time Kira Earth slash Umi would have got here, that immediately they would have got their final power up. But no, y'all made us wait, like, 
not that long, but long for it. And, it, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm happy. Let me check something real quick to make sure that this show is also getting, like, a show ain't airing next week. Because I feel, because I've already been told it's not, that it's not going to air next week. It's going to be on a break. And then after that, it's coming back again. So, let me see. Mm, episode this scroll all the way down to October. That's August, August, September, 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 October, October 11th, October 18th, my birthday, um, 29, 20, yeah, November, Jesus Christ, November 8th, are y'all serious, like, that's literally almost two weeks away, oh my god, that's two weeks! That is literally two weeks. I mean, you know what? We, we've we honestly waited longer, but I get the fact that they're doing this, like, two, one, one week, two week hiatus. I get that because of the fact is that, like, the way, imagine if, you know, COVID didn't happen and this didn't get postponed and ish. I, do I think they would have made a break possibly for it after this episode or getting ready to come to 31 and ish? Maybe. I'm not really so sure, but because, you know. We can't go back in time and see. We'll never know. But I, I, I can't speak. <laughs> I, I like the way this ended. I'm glad that we're having a two-parter episode. I think because the last time we had one was like early, early into the show. And that was with um, Hinata like quitting and saying that she doesn't want to be a pretty here anymore because of the fact is, you know, yeah, as a pretty here, you're in danger almost like all the freaking time. Not only you, but sometimes, you know, your friends, your family, your extended family who maybe comes to visit for like one random episode. But I mean, out of all the things, it was Kota's dad. And I think that's a lot more hurtful. If it was Kota, like I, I probably would have been really crying right now because Kota's just, he seems like such a little sweet, innocent kid. And he was getting his arc redeemed because of the fact is him and Soichi finally made up by the end of this episode and everything seemed like it was going to end um, peacefully and happily. But with the fact is that, you know, we only had like this much left. And I was like, yeah, where's what's her face? She going to pop up. And then she did. And oh God. But fi like I said, finally, these girls are getting their last freaking power up. Cause oh my God. I mean, how long did it take? Like go Prince is pretty cute to get their final power up. I mean, Ooh, Ooh, <laughs> now I kind of want to rewatch go princess. <laughs> I mean, it makes you wonder, like, you look back on every freaking season of Pretty Cure and be like, how long did it take y'all to get that fire power up? Like, oh, God. I mean, it takes, like, moments. Uh, like, th think about, like, Sailor Moon or something, especially. Especially Sailor Moon and her final power up. She doesn't get it, like, until it's, like, really, really close. Until everyone's like, yeah, we gotta put all of our power into Sailor Moon for her to, like, mm, evolve. But that's the one thing why I love Sailor Moon so much. Even though it could take forever sometimes and some episodes could sometimes be filler or not but still it's still good but this two week hiatus <laughs> that's not fair but I'm kind of glad that I was able to watch this now instead of um over the weekend I think if I didn't watch this episode and I probably waited um personally until the day 20 I mean not 29 31 came out and put these two together maybe that would have been better but I'm like no I'm like go ahead and get it out now but yeah the way it ended was really good and I honestly cannot wait to see what could happen next and how their final power up is gonna go and so we can literally inject pretty care into ourselves I'm just saying but yeah other than that guys that is my reaction review towards episode 30 of healing good pretty here if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel I make videos every single day join the master squad and of course I will see you guys in less than two weeks for episode 31 <laughs> bye guys